In this video, agents learn how to complete an Agent Visual Inspection Disclosure Form, or AVID, on a mobile device. In this scenario, the agent uses a smartphone to open the Glide site, locate the AVID page, and complete the workflow. The agent also sends the AVID form to the client for signature. Let's get started. On the Glide homepage, select a transaction. On the Transaction Overview page, click Disclosure Package. Scroll down to Complete AVID and click the Start button. On the next page, select Use Glide's Guided AVID Workflow. There's another option, but in this example, we're not going to upload a completed PDF. Click Continue. The next page asks if this is a multifamily dwelling. In this example, we select No. Click Continue. Enter the name of the brokerage for the transaction. In this example, we enter Glide Labs. Click Next. On the next page, enter the inspection date and time. In this example, we use the default settings. You can change that information. Click Continue. On the next page, enter the weather conditions on the day of the inspection. You can use the default weather conditions that are automatically added for your location or edit the information. Click Continue. Enter the names of the people present for the inspection besides yourself, if applicable. In this example, no other people were present, so we enter the words, just me. Click Continue. The next step is to add your property observations to the form. Click the Add New button. On the Add Property Observations page, Select a space. In this example, we select bedroom. Give the bedroom a number. You can change the figure according to the number of bedrooms in the property. This feature allows you to make observations for specific bedrooms. Enter your comments. Click the Take Photo button if you want. You can take a picture from your device and attach it to the AVID form to confirm or add additional insights to an observation. This step is optional, but you can easily take a photo while you're on the property and upload it to the AVID form in one step. The image is added to the observations. Click the Attach File button if you want. Use this feature if you want to add a document or other file to the observation. In this example, we're not going to attach any files. Click Save. The observation for that space is recorded. To add more observations, click the Add New button and repeat the steps. Click Edit if you want to change the information in an observation. Click Done after you finish the last observation. On the next page, answer a question about additional observations not mentioned before. In this example, we enter, these are the observations from the agent and are objective. Click Continue. On the next page, answer the question about an addendum. In this example, we do not have an addendum. Click No and then Continue to close the observations section. Once the AVID is generated, you can see a confirmation screen. You can download the form or send it for signature with DocuSign. In this example, we click Sign with DocuSign. Glide auto tabs signature fields on the AVID for agents and other parties. On the Prepare page, verify the information. Add documents and recipients if you want. Scroll down the page to the two check boxes. Check the first box if you want Glide to automatically add signature tabs to all of the documents you send. Check the second box if you want Glide to replace the original documents in the transaction folder with fully executed documents. 
Click Continue. On the next page, you can see the document inside a DocuSign envelope. Verify all the information is correct. Scroll down the page to check the form and signature tabs. Click Next. You can see the completed form and images if you added pictures to the observations. Click Send. After you click the Send button, Glide returns to the Transaction Overview page. Scroll down the page and click Disclosure Package under Quick Access. Here you can check the status of your AVID signature requests. That's it, we're done. In this video, you learned how to complete an AVID form on a mobile device and send it for signature.